how to cast off or bind off left-handed. In order to get all of the work off of our needle and not unravel, we need to bind off or cast off. What I've already done is knitted one stitch from my right-hand needle onto my left-hand needle. Now we're going to go ahead and knit a second stitch from our right hand onto our left hand needle. Now we're going to use a technique called passing over. We will go under the needle, the loop that it, the first on the left hand needle, and we're simply going to draw it over the second loop. This now decreases our total count from two to one. We will go ahead, knit another, now we're at two. We are going to now pass this over the second stitch and leave us with one again. We're going to keep repeating that process. Knit to two, pass to one. Knit to two. Then we're going to just go under the first loop and pass it over and off to one. So no matter what, once I finish, I am decreasing from two loops to one loop every single time. Now I'm reaching the end. I'm going to knit this last stitch off. I have two. I'm going to do the same thing. I am going to pass this stitch. Now I'm down to one. Now I'm going to make this loop really big. You would cut your yarn, but I'm already at the end of my skein, so I'm just going to take it and I'm going to bring it all right through the big loop that we made. Pull, and there you go. You have a nice, neat, bound edge that won't unravel. You can also go ahead and crochet an edge onto this. It's a little tough to see because it's black, but this looks very much like a crocheted edge when you finish off. So that's really all there is to binding off left-handed. Happy knitting!